it's Daniela. This week's theme on Daniela Bodo is how not to blank. A few weeks ago I did how to blank, but this week it's how not to blank. So I thought I would show you how not to do your homework. And a little fun fact, this video was originally made a long time ago, like about seven months ago, but it, but it was around the time when my camera broke and I was in the middle of making this video when my old camera broke, um, like it fell down, I was grabbing something and the tripod fell down and it broke and I was in the middle of making this video and a few weeks ago I, um, I was looking at the videos on my old memory card because I just so happened to still have it and I found this video and I decided to remake it. So I'm just going to remake this video. So anyways, without further ado, let's get this party started. Woo! Do you have so much homework but you just don't feel like doing it all? Or do you not have a lot of homework but you have some homework but you just don't feel like doing it well you've come to the right place if you absolutely hate doing homework here is how to get it done and to how to get it done really quickly and go back to watching videos or whatever else you want to do the first step is to sit on your bed and think of excuses for not doing your homework So you're just casually thinking of excuses and the first one that comes to mind is... My dog ate my homework! But everybody knows that that excuse has been overused a lot. So what if we put a little twist well, to that excuse? What if we said... Well, night we ate homework and I just so happened to eat the assignment from last night. So the next step is to grab your homework and we'll eat it. And yes, there is a possibility for digestive problems, but who cares about that right now? Just eat it and get it over with. But of course, if you're afraid of the digestive problems part, I've got you covered with the next step. The next step deals with doing your homework but not doing it the proper way. All you gotta do is grab your homework, and if it's math homework, open the calculator app on your phone and have the calculator do all the work for you. Or if your homework is for another subject, then just Google the answers. That's the purpose of Google, right? But if you don't even feel like writing the answers down, Here's the third and final step. And that is to simply just ignore your homework. Then the next day when the teacher tells you to turn it in, just simply tell them that you forgot to do it because it wasn't on the agenda. Then keep on ignoring it for as long as possible. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, make sure to give it a ginormous thumbs up and yeah so if you guys want to be a good candidate for a shout out in my next video then give this video a humongous thumbs up and comment down below do you like homework or do you not like it i don't dislike or like homework i hate homework um so comment down below do you love homework do you like homework do you dislike it or do you hate it? I hate it, personally. So yeah, don't forget to give this video a humongous thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already because I love to make videos and I make one every single weekend here on Daniela Bodo. So, um, so make sure to subscribe to my channel if you want to see new videos every single weekend. So yeah, so that's pretty much it, and I will see you guys, the subscribers and viewers, in my next video. Yeah.